guys we just disassembled the asus n53 jf uh, that was the time lapse and we changed the fan and clean it because it's so dirty first we disassemble the main board motherboard or what you prefer same and remove, remove the fan and get back, back it together now first we remove those cables attached to the motherboard supply in some antennas and the Wi-Fi card we have to remove here is the Wi-Fi card half size and don't forget to organize the screws especially their M2 metric 2 by 4 by 2.5 by 7 2.5 by 7 2.5 by 10 and remove the Wi-Fi card it's easy actually if you like you can remove the uh, antenna cables and uh, here is the display connection it's important i have to figure it out how to remove it the way just push it out okay and secure it somewhere else let's look in we have some screws here uh, I couldn't uh, gonna remove it but I will try it my way it got broken it's got two piece from the back panel I think or it's just still there to save the more it's two point by two point five by seven put it there look to the memory there are still connections look at the back there is nothing okay we don't forget we didn't forget anything to remove I think we have to remove these sockets let's do it it's a Luigi AK a living help this it comes off and this one is the fan I think fan cable 
Yes. Comes off right away. And turn it back. It's looking now. Does it come off? Oh, that's. It won't. Because there are some screws here. We forget. We didn't see it. Yes. It's a 2.555. Let's put it in here. We group all the screws here. And there is a it's written on the plastic panels which one is it Be careful about the cables I don't want to broke it and there is a screw here hold the fan just do it slowly I didn't do it before, but it's easy, I think. Yes, it's popped away. Yeah, and there's a cable also. Which one is it? Yes, this. This little guy. Get off. Come on. Oh my god, I was broken. Mm. Yes. It's popped up. And you see it. It's a lot of dirt here. Oh my god dust actually it's a dust not a dirt not too many hairs there was something else just dust and fan is not blowing actually blowing but it's make noise it's squishy it's, I don't know what to say it's make noise and here we are this is the main board and we put the case here we have to remove these aluminum foil I don't, I don't know do you see it yes remove this aluminum foil and we remove the fan actually this is the the radiator uh, side fan is oh my god here Actually, I, I think there is another tape yes this is the tape we have to remove Just push, pull. I just pull it. I don't know what will happen. It's so hard. That holds the whole fan. The sticker. <clears throat> yes, it's coming off. Here we are. Yeah. And the fan is come off. Oh my god. Do you see it? How dirty is it? And you have to see this. There is a carpet <laughs> with dust from this. It's it's so dirty. And tape 
I think we'll stick. The <laughs> dust will stick. Oh my god. I have to clean it. Okay. Uh, I will clean and I will see you again. And by the way, I I will show you the new one. This is the old one. And here is the new one. I bought it from eBay. Actually, gittigidior.com. Uh, it's a part of eBay. It's a Turkish uh, partner of eBay. The same working type. It's about ten bucks with shipping. Uh, it looks same. Yeah, circuits are same. How about the details? It's actually identical. Yes, it's identical. I think there is a Delta Electronics made in China, Delta Electronics made in China, 0 0.4 amp DC, 5 volts. I think there is a serial number. I don't know what is that. But it looks same. This is plastic and there is a curve. There is a bump, little, I think, two millimeter bump, but it does not have a bump. Let's put it on. Same, same spots, yes, same holes everywhere. Just a little bump is there. Do you see? Little bump, but it doesn't have any bump. Any height. And it should have because this blower sign is bigger because of this pump. This bump, this height two millimeter bigger and this is narrower and it goes right in okay it's not important it's not working at, at least it's working i hope so i didn't run it yet i will try on the main board i will i hope this is working okay put it here and see you later i will clean it now Bye. hello again i just cleaned uh, the pieces and i will put a new phone in now this our fan we call it turkish in fun <laughs> Sometimes I forget to say fan. It's a fun. Yes, this is the new one. And there is no noise, no dust. It's cool, right? Just a millimeter difference on the blower side. Do you see? It's just a just a millimeter but it's okay it's 10 bucks 10 us dollars and i'll put it here and to the cable oh yes this way and i will cover the aluminium foil it's a really hard aluminum oh, I? Yes. Use, I use guitar pick to open uh, the case and I will use it again it's a one millimeter passion actually it's a two millimeter passion 
by Jaji Jaji yes I have to remove and turn it back and put it again One is free to hang, there is nothing to hold it hold it in position, just this tape. I'll put a cello cello bunt, cello tape, cello type, I don't know, it's a tape. And make the alignment and stick it. There was no such a stick. <laughs> Just a little. I hold the pen. It's okay. I will screw it anyway. And here is the screw. And now, how did we <laughs> know? Anybody remember? Okay, let me try. Take housing here and careful about the display port cable. And put it back here, right there. All the holes will be fixed. There is nothing to the left, I think. Bit of a forget, right? Let's check it again. This phone will be, it will be connected here. Let's connect it first. There is a macaron on it. It's just tight to bend. It's okay. Um, yes, this way. Yep. It's okay. Done. Be careful about the capacitor here. And okay, then let's put it back. Careful about the connectors, careful about the holes, it's just the main board, it's the main board, we used to say main board, but now, uh, last 10 years, it's changed to motherboard, I don't know, main board, it's cooler, yes, now we screw the Screw the screws, but which one is it? Oh my god, let's pull it. That's it is two point five. Yes, two point five. Probably two point five by five. Yeah, that's okay. And the other one is also. 
Running with C7. There are some triangles that you have to screw in. And first, I will put the display port cable. It's a bit tricky. But it's okay. I don't want to hurt it. Connect the Wi Fi here. It's connected, and it has two screws, a uh, metric two by four. It's connected, screw in. The housing. And the other one so I hope I won't have any screws left. Because I always do. And this is oh, it's a cable for power. connected and this little friend it's speaker it has bang and Olufsen 4 ohm 3 watts each total it's 6 watts it's amazing sound this laptop has amazing sound also I have uh, another Asus laptop it's K 53 this is n53 k53 has a macbook style keyboard but it's its sound is terrible it's so synthetic it's so bad i don't know just the speaker but this is speaker Let's put it back. <laughs> yes, it's done. Well, we don't have any screws, are we? There is another hole, but no triangle. I think it's done. Okay. If we forget, we go back to the beginning again. And what we what we gonna do now? Main board is stable. Fan is stable. And turn back. What do we forget? Yes, this cable. Yeah. It's an audio cable. Audio module cable. It has also two USBs and mic in and headset out. Connected 
let's check the antennas. Uh, I don't want to have a Wi-Fi problem. Yeah, we have some problem here. We couldn't make it right. Yes, that's done. Also, let's clean these dust. It's a cable for what it's just hanging. I don't know what I just want to. Oh, it's a speaker right here. It's a main word. Speaker, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. Let's put the cover back. There was a, some, there was some uh, screw holder broke, I think, or I don't know. It must be here. This must be here. It's, it has an aluminum coil. That's not this way. broken I have to use this use what use a glue yes there's some oh my god it's it's so tight going to do fucked up yes I think I should do with the screwdriver or I need to do it right now. Done and put it here. Yes, it's okay. It's just fine. Check and check for another one because I saw, yes, here, here on the back. On the speaker side. A little glue. Oh, I have. This is easier. Yes. Yeah. 
It's okay, it's fine. It's a little screw housing in it, but it's a plastic cover. It's a plastic holding material. It just broke. It's that's a plastic man. By the way, this is about this in 2010. It's a six years old computer, laptop, notebook. I prefer. There is no blocking. Uh -huh. It's fine. It's done. Done, done, done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight screws. I don't know, I don't want to forget anything. It's okay. Just a couple of screws I forget. Like this. Be careful. Oh, I forgot to clean this side. Use some alcohol and I use cotton sticks. You can see it. Yeah. I use Asus Zenfone 2 32 gigabytes version to record the video. I love Asus. It's it's a good good brand. It's it has quality products and price performance ratio is very good. Let's go back to time lapse. Assemble a PC and power on. We are in a BIOS. Yes, and it boots. There is no 
fun speed uh, setting or any information here good selection all CZ vertex 4 right and times correct another fancy stroke it's all correct. We start. I have set uh, SSD SATA three, but laptop supports only SATA two, and I have a Windows ten, but it has some problems I think it's incompatible uh, first I uh, installed the Windows 10 it opens about 10 seconds it closes about, uh, it turns off it's shut down by 4 seconds uh, but it's now it's it took about minutes it's take about minute to open minute to launch the windows i don't know why there is a problem i will reinstall and format uh, the ssd to zero let's wait it seems normal now yes there is it's fun fun is working there is some heat yes it blows heat Right. Wait just another minute. There is some smell. It smells like burnt plastic. I think fun is new. <laughs> I hope there is no problem. It's okay, I think. Come on, launch the windows. We are waiting. And I use just a Philips screwdriver and tweezer. And flathead screwdriver. I, I didn't use this. I use some guitar picks. Just one guitar pick, actually. Yes, it's the best. I use it for bass. And here is our SD protector. Fun is working. Okay. I think I have to reinstall the windows as soon as possible. Thank you for watching me.